Hi, I'm Arnie Carlson, and I live out in Plymouth. Uh, let me just spend a moment with you on why I'm endorsing Terry Bonhoff for the state senate. Um, I think it's about time we start to get more moderates uh, into the Minnesota legislature. We can't afford uh, the extremism that we're currently going through. Uh, I really thought the last budget settlement of 2011 was an absolute disaster. Uh, we literally took money from the future, revenues from the future, to pay for today's expenses. And then we borrowed heavily and we refused to pay back the money to K-12 through education. Frankly, that comes out to about a loan of roughly $3,000 uh, per student, uh, having to kick in to balance the state's budget because the legislature did not have the courage to make the fundamental choices of either reducing spending and doing it in a thoughtful way or raising taxes. And likewise, if you do that, do that in a thoughtful way. Terry Bonoff had the courage uh, to challenge her caucus and to move into the middle and vote against that. I like that very, very much. I'm also disturbed uh, by this tendency on the part of the Tea Party Republican Party uh, to take their personal uh, misfortunes, if you will, and make the public pay for it. I'm upset by the Broadcorp scandal. I, I truthfully am. And the idea that we're going to rack up hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars in legal bills and settlement costs, and then we, the taxpayer, are to pay for somebody else's sex scandal, I find that offensive, absolutely offensive. But more than anything else, I think we have to start to develop a budget that is a growth-oriented budget. How do, you in, how do you create a budget and a tax system that encourages investment, and investment in what? In cutting edge technology. That's where Minnesota has always grown its jobs. Uh, and we're not doing that. Uh, we haven't balanced our budget now for 10 years without heavy borrowing. And now we have another deficit coming up, and it will be about $4.4 billion. So it'll be the same old routine. No new taxes, more borrowing, more pushing down on, on the property tax. And Terry Bonoff, I think, gives us a fresh approach, uh, a willingness to work with higher education talent, a willingness to work with business talent, uh, a willingness to work with legislative talent and the talent in the administration, bring them together and see if we can develop a new approach to how we budget our priorities and spend properly on our priorities, and at the same time have a tax system that is not only fair, but encourages investment and encourages growth. So I think it's in all of our best interest uh, to make certain that Terry Bonhoff gets back in the Minnesota State Senate. Thank you very much.